Good morning to you. I'm meteorologist Caroline Carithers with the News 5 First Alert Storm Team here with your Friday morning, November 17th tropical update. We only have one area that we are tracking in the tropics here. We have potential tropical cyclone 22 and right now it's looking at max winds at around 35 miles per hour. It's moving to the northeast at around 14 miles per hour. It's currently in the northern Caribbean and it is heading toward the eastern tip of Cuba. So looking at the latest update from the National Hurricane Center, it is looking a little bit less likely that this will become a tropical system as it approaches Cuba. It was originally forecast to become Vince either today or tomorrow, but it doesn't look like that's going to happen. It's really enduring some dry air as well as some wind shear, which has it struggling a little bit. Now, the Hurricane Center forecast does have this be eventually becoming tropical storm Vince after it emerges off of the mountainous tip of Cuba and into the Atlantic. But those chances are decreasing as well because it does look like there will be some wind shear out there during that time too. So it's a little bit up in the air as far as intensity goes and as far as tropical cyclone formation goes. But what is certain is that this is not a threat to the United States or our threat of the Gulf Coast, our stretch of the Gulf Coast, excuse me, it's going to head toward Cuba and then eventually towards Bermuda in the Atlantic. No threat to the United States. If you need to stay up to date with all the latest in the tropics, you'd head, head to WKRG.com and search for our hurricane map room.